Hi, this is Mary Wisner from the Gallagher Law Library. This is our third and final short lesson on law review articles. We've talked about what they are, scholarly legal periodicals, and where to look up articles when you have citations, Hein Online, Lexis, and Westlaw. In this lesson, we'll demonstrate how to search. Searching enables you to follow your interests, whether it's finding authority for a client's case, working on a class assignment, or learning more about a topic you care about. You can search journal articles in Hein Online, Lexis, and Westlaw. You can also use Google Scholar, which covers many fields, in addition to law. I won't demonstrate Google Scholar today because I assume you have seen Google searching. Hein Online, Lexis, and Westlaw all allow you to use Boolean connectors. For example, you can search for an article that has the word snowmobile and the word trespasser, or you could look for the word snowmobile or snowcat. All the systems have a truncation symbol. In Hein Online, it's an asterisk. So negligent with an asterisk finds negligence, negligent, and negligently. In Lexis and Westlaw, that symbol is an exclamation mark. All three systems also give you an option of requiring a term to be in a particular field, for instance, the title field. In Hein Online, let's go to the Law Journal Library and click on Advanced Search. If we look for Class Action and Civil Rights, we get over 400,000 results. That's a lot more than I want to deal with. What if we go back to Advanced Search and look for all of those words to be in the article's title? Now we have just 22 articles which is a more reasonable number to browse. Let's turn to Lexis. In both Lexis and Westlaw, you can search across all types of content and then filter down to law review articles. I think it's more efficient to start with law review articles. So here from the main menu, I'm going to choose law reviews and journals. The easiest search is a natural language search where I just type in terms without any connectors. For example, Feminist Critique, Reasonable Man Standard, Torts. I get 274 articles, and they're sorted by relevance, which is determined by Lexis's algorithm. I could also choose to have them sorted by date or other factors. I'm going to also show you a Boolean search. Again, I'm choosing Law Reviews and Journals, a good way to get into the Boolean option is to click on Advanced Search. That shows you on the right-hand side here what connectors are available. It also indicates document fields that you can use. So, for example, I can search for the phrase War on Drugs to be within 50 words of mass incarceration. And then I can look through these articles. Similarly, we can go into Westlaw. In Westlaw, we could also search the whole collection and filter to law review articles, or we can start with law review articles. I'm going down here in the menu to secondary sources. Within secondary sources, there are different options. I'm choosing law reviews and journals. For a natural language search, I can look for access to justice, poverty, right to counsel, civil. Now, sometimes natural language searches give you way too much to deal with. In this case, we have over 10,000 articles. My default sort was by date. If I change that to sorting by relevance, then my first several articles are about the civil right to counsel. Now, again, we can get into Boolean searching by clicking on Advanced. They tell you what connectors are available, they also show you fields that you can use. Let's say we want variations of vote, voting voter, in the title. We put in VOT exclamation point. And somewhere in the article, we want voter suppression to be in the same paragraph as identification. And now we have 71 articles. And you see that they have voting or voter in the title. And somewhere inside, they have voter suppression close to identification. 
Let's review. We've learned that law reviews are scholarly legal periodicals. You can look them up when you have a citation in Hein Online, Lexis, or Westlaw. You can search for them in Hein Online, Lexis, Westlaw, and Google Scholar. I'm Mary Wisner from the Gallagher Law Library. Please see our website for library services, research guides, and more, lib.law.uw.edu.